Good morning, good afternoon, good night, everyone. I am that one guy, and today I'm playing with a new mouse. So this video is the perfect opportunity for me to do the standard sort of a uh, hybrid commentary that I normally do, because I am I can talk about the game, I can talk about the the mouse, which is the topic of the video, and I can talk about my birthday. So if you've been following me for more than like seven seconds, you will know that I've been complaining about my mouse a whole bunch, like 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 a little bit too much. Now, I'd spent far too long killing that guy, but I will explain why in just a moment. So my first impressions of the mouse is that it's it's just so lightweight. Like, my old mouse was pushing 80 grams, I think. But this one, this one's 67, I think. So if you can't already tell, this is the glorious Model O. It's, it's a pretty snazzy little device. It's really light, and it's really popular for Minecraft people. I just brought the wrong thing on accident, damn it. This video is basically just going to be a giant excuse for my future videos. And by an excuse, I mean the fact that I'm not going to be able to play as well as I normally can, just due to the fact that I have not used this mouse before, I'm not used to it. It's very different to what I would want in a mouse. Like, don't get me wrong, I like the mouse, like 100%, but at the same time, it's not something I'm used to with the weight. And because of that, the aim distribution is really different. And because I have to aim differently, because everything is, you know, lightweight and different to press. So, yeah, I'm going to play very terribly in this video. So I'm sorry for that. I'm also doing a hand cam for, like, the first time in, you know, a, a while on this channel. I know I did one once before in the past. So I know that a lot of people are going to be like, Ben, are you going to become Bedless Noob? Are you going to drag click and Godbridge everywhere? Uh, oh gosh, hi, hi, hi. Whoa, 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 what? I was not focusing on the game at all. <laughs> oh, but the answer is, I don't really think so, I, I guess. Like, I have been practicing my Godbridging. I have been practicing my moonwalking. But at the same time, I'm, I, I, I'm more worried about my own, my ability to aim. And this guy's ability to block clutch, I'm also kind of worried about that. If I do... this... Then, he's in the void. Ooh, that was stressy. He says, okay, KB. Uh, glorious model O. Yes, that is the reason. I don't know. But yes, I am aware of the notorious butterfly clicking capabilities of the mouse. But I'm not sure if I can get into that, you know, too soon. Because I, I don't understand how I'm meant to butterfly click properly. I understand the concepts of butterfly clicking. Like, it makes sense to me. Like, yeah, you can click faster if you butterfly click because, you know, your, your hands move in that alternating pattern. You know, it makes sense. But what doesn't make sense to me is just... Oh, gosh. Ah! Is just why I can't do it right. I don't know, I can't hold it and do that because it makes my other fingers twitch up and down. Uh, that's just because I'm weird. Wait, how did I die? Oh, that, that guy killed me? From over there. Okay, I'm getting attacked from this side now. Very nice. Yeah, so we'll be trying to butterfly click a little bit on like right mouse button for those, you know, sweet, sweet... He's got a fireball. Yep. Bedwars play- Bed- Ah! I was about to say that Bedwars players were very predictable and then he just did that. Do you have a third one, buddy? Do you have a third? <sighs> yep. I died to full damage. Of course I did. Due to the lightweight nature of the mouse, my my actual issue is the fact that it feels like I'm playing at a higher sensitivity because I have to move my hand with less effort. It's I call it the strong guy effect. You know when someone's like really strong and then they go to pick something up and it feels really lightweight because they're strong. Well, yeah, that's, that's how I'm feeling right now. He's got better gear than me. No, I have prop, but he doesn't. Interesting. Very interesting. So yeah, I have been complaining about the mouse for, for a while. But the reason why I got I finally got it replaced is because it was my birthday on Thursday. It's currently Saturday when I'm recording this. And you'll watch this on a Wednesday, so that doesn't really make sense. I'd like to blame my death on the fact that I uh, couldn't aim properly due to uh, not being used to this mouse. Yeah, that is, that is, that is it. That is the only reason why I died just then. It wasn't because he had sharp iron and I had no, and I had like prop one. It was just, you know, it was sheer, sheer, uh, mouse issue. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The fantastic thing is, I don't know where he is. 
This is less fantastic. I have come to the conclusion that this guy has disappeared off the face of the earth. Wait, <gasps> there he is. But I got some other things on my birthday as well. For it, I'll... No. I hate this guy. This is, this is a toxic, toxic way to play. Like, why would you play like this? That actually is kind of smart, not gonna lie. If you make the TNT jump, it would be pretty cool. But you didn't. You just embarrassed yourself in front of your whole family. Imagine if your family was watching this YouTube video. Imagine how embarrassing that would be. Aqua. This is just going to be another wild goose chase. I swear, whenever I pay, play on this map, it's just it just becomes a wild goose chase mode. Now, if he gets to blue base, he fell by himself. Of course he fell by himself. Welcome to round two, and it is actually... Uh, tomorrow in relation to yesterday, which was the day that I started recording this video. Now, I don't normally record videos over the span of two days, but yesterday ended up being pretty bad for me. So, yeah. Wait, this is... I hate this map already. So, boy, do I have some stories to tell you. But I'm going to try my best to... But I'm just going to try and space out the story well enough. So, let's... Let's go with the first... Why can't I bridge today? So my mouse wasn't the only thing that I got for my birthday. I did get a couple other things as well. Oh, and there's a final for me. Hell yeah. Also, yeah, I did change the camera angle. I'm not really sure why. I sort of just felt like it, so I did. I just feel like this camera angle would be like, you know, just a little bit better for your own little eyes. However big or small they may be. So in the morning, like... So in the morning that I actually got the mouse itself, my parents were like, hey Ben, turn your computer on, you know, you can, you can plug your mouse in, see how it goes, you know, have a bit of fun with it, uh oh, have a bit of fun with it, like, you know, I'm not going to play video games, but obviously I can plug it into my computer and give it a little shot, just, just to install drivers and all that cool stuff. So, of course, I obviously did that, because who doesn't want to plug in their brand new gaming mouse? So, so do my deed, plug it in. It's all good. And then... No sec. There you go. I'm not so terrible at this game. Just kidding. <laughs> I know that I occasionally get these little spikes of skill, but trust me, I am playing very badly at the moment. So when the time came around when my parents asked me like what I wanted for my birthday, I basically just explained that I wanted a mouse, and then, you know, I'd said which mouse I wanted, because obviously saying computer mouse isn't the smartest thing to do to your parents. Especially ones that aren't particularly uh, inclined with technology. Like, they're not not—they're not dumb. It's just that, you know, they're not really in the scene for gaming and, and all, all that jazz. I hate myself. So I didn't really want to be a greedy boy or anything. So on my birthday, I asked for the mouse and that was it. I didn't expect anything else. I didn't ask for anything else. I didn't particularly want anything else. I was pretty happy with, you know, what I had. I was appreciative of what, you know, what I had and... How I used it. Because, you know, I, I take care of everything that I own. Like my old mouse lasted me, what, like seven or eight years? So, you know, I really proved myself there. I thought, hey, um, this is cool. So I plugged my new mouse in, and it was all fine and dandy. I know I already said this once. But then... Oh, five, we'll jump over to you. Nope. Do you, have a, do you have a sword? That is a tough sword. This is, this is going to be a very close game. Wow. Oh, I don't like that. I don't like that. So apparently we have two rounds on the same map. I'm sorry about that. I, I didn't really realize I was busy um, practicing my drag clicking. Which I'm, you know, I'm getting better at. So all I actually asked for was a new mouse. And, like, some people might think that's, that's a lot to ask for. What is... This is a cursed map. Some people might think that it's a lot to ask for. Some people might think it's not much. But for me, it was... It was what I was, you know, appropriately allowed to ask for. For me, it's okay to ask for something sometimes. I'm not much of a money-grabbing gremlin of a child. So while I was setting up the mouse in the morning before school, my dad was like, Ben, is your computer normally this slow? And I'm like, yeah, yeah, it, it really is. Because I had a mechanical hard drive, which was also failing, which isn't very good at all. You know, we had a... You know, a short-lived discussion about that while I ate my breakfast before school, of course. 
And then when we got back home, my dad's like, hey, Ben, can you grab one of the um, hard drive platters off the bookshelf, please? I'm like, oh, okay, no problem. Uh, just for some backstory, we have about, I don't know how many, like 100 terabytes of random hard drives lying around. Now, some of them had sensitive information, so for you know, reasons, we didn't want to keep them around. So we disposed of them in the best way that we knew how, which was destroying them and then, uh oh, that was bad. Which was just kind of destroying them and then hoping for the best. So I actually use one of those platters in my room as a mirror because I'm a strange, strange lad. Is this guy going to jump down on me or what? Because I'm waiting for him. There we go. See, I am capable of doing a thing in a block game. Sometimes. Except for when hit reg doesn't work, then it's then it's all then it's all fun and games. So I grab him one of the hard drive platters, which is the you know little metal spinny bit that's inside, and I give it to him, and he's like, "No, Ben, Ben, you're you're an absolute spud. Go go back." I'm like, "Okay." So I go back, and I realize that I somehow missed the gift wrapped present and the like secondary birthday card that was there. I'm not really sure how I missed it. I guess I just used muscle memory to snatch the the platter. Hey, how did he clutch that? No, 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 no. Okay. I know Gray's. This is horrible. Okay, Gray killed himself. Very fantastic. That's fantastic for me. So I open up my gift, and it turns out it's a fancy, fancy, fancy SSD. Like one of the one of those blazing fast ones. So now my computer's. You know, blazingly speedy when it comes to booting up. If, I hope this guy doesn't bed trade with me. I hope he actually runs at me. Oh, he's running at me. Okay. If I run up here, I can't do that. Alright, now if I if I do this, does Ben have the mad jukes? Yes, he does. So that's cool. I actually have an SSD now, so my computer boots up quickly and does things quickly. And you know, the hard drive isn't failing. That's always a massive bonus. But then there was a third birthday present. And this is this is one that I really didn't expect because you know, you, you sort of, oh, uh, okay. So this last present was pretty epic, not gonna lie. All right, are you ready to hear it? Are you ready? Okay, just imagine, imagine a very dramatic drum roll, please, okay? Just, just imagine one for me. Look, viewers, viewers, I'm I'm sorry for making a fool of myself. I know this isn't the kind of content that you wanted, but you know, it, I, I can't I can't do anything functional today. I just cracked my knuckle really loudly. That might actually help. Ah, why are we so sweaty? I just wanted to talk about my birthday present. All right, so drum roll, please. Okay, so. My third birthday present was a. Let's say I'm gonna, I'm gonna reveal it when I get a brand new toilet seat. That was um um. I, I don't know how you feel about that because you only just heard it, but uh, that that that's what I got for my birthday. So yet again, on the topic of me taking care of things, I had this toilet seat for I don't know, God knows how long, like. 10 years? I don't really know. I just know that it was kind of broken because my, uh, I don't really know. Just the hingy spot where it actually attaches onto the rest of the toilet was broken. So my dad just went, hey, you know what, Ben, you, you're going to get a new toilet. So, <laughs> so I got a new, um, throne for my bum, I guess. Am I even allowed to say that on YouTube? Uh, Susan, I know that you're the CEO. Please don't, uh, ruin my chances at monetization. I know that you've been giving me watch time lately and I really appreciate that. So if you could please like spare me a bit, then that would be cool. All right, so this, this new toilet seat has some really cool features. Like, D don't get me wrong, it's not like a smart toilet or something. This this ain't the Gucci smart toilet. This is, it, it's just a regular old toilet seat. But, 
what is going on with my bridging? But, and no pun intended, it doesn't freeze my bollocks off when I sit on it. And you know what? I love that. I love that I can go to the toilet at whatever time of day, at whatever season of the year, and I can just, you know, not want to die a little bit inside. No, I'm, I'm trying not to do BLTMI about the... <laughs> At the damn toilet seat, <laughs> but you know, it, it's cool and I'm excited about it. Okay, now I do have one complaint about this toilet seat though, and that's the fact that it's really squeaky. And like, I'm talking like honeymoon bed kind of squeaky, or you know, me from any video before 2019 kind of squeaky. It's, it, it, it makes creaky noises every two seconds. I actually take back uh, comments I said about my voice. Well, my voice was pretty high and squeaky. This toilet seat is squeaky like two Catholics on their wedding night. I think I'm going to stop with the innuendos because someone's going to get mad at me eventually. No premarital eye contact, am I right? So yeah, th those were my birthday gifts this year. So I have a question for you, loyal viewer of my channel. What do you do for your birthday? Like, do you have- are you the kind of person to have a party? Are you kind of the person just, you know, to stay home and, you know, watch a movie with your family? Like, what do you do? What are your normal birthday arrangements? Because mine, mine, mine are very, uh, what's the word? Chill. Okay, this, this might work. Please work, please work. Yes! Yes, die! Ah. Uh. Also, if you've ever had a birthday party, like, please tell me what it's like. Because I've never had a birthday party before. Like, ever. I, um, I, I don't know why, I, I kind of just, I, I sort of just didn't have one at any point during my life. I also haven't gone on a sleepover either. Is that weird? I, I mean, I don't know if it is, but is it? Tell me, tell me in the comments, okay? Feel free to bully me in the comments as well. I really don't mind all that much. Just don't say anything racist or derogatory or terrible. And not calling me Hitler, that would also be nice. I know that people in on my stream like to do that for some reason. Uh, Twitch.tv slash YT that one guy, by the way. Fireball! That did not work. Eh? Fireball! Not fireball, but you know what I mean. Ding! I have another story, and this one will probably be quick, because I think that I have enough footage for this video. Oh my gosh, that just happened. Whoa. Whoa, that was... I did not expect that to happen. Okay, boys and girls and others, this is not the end of the video. We have more to do, and I have another story to tell. So this was my story that happened this morning. Well, at about 1am this morning, to be exact. So I was doing my thing in bed, also known as sleeping like a child. And it was, I think it was around 50 minutes past midnight. It's so like... Um, I, I, I don't know, I... People argue with me all the time about what time you should call a certain time of day. So, 50 minutes past midnight. You understand what I mean by that? Okay, so that's what we're going to be talking about today. I'm sorry if that offends you in some way. But, like, don't don't be a sensitive little snowflake. Okay, we really have enough of those in Australia. Ah, yikes. Oh. You know what we're doing? We're doing one more round. We're doing one more round. I want to tell my story now. So I've actually gotten a lot better drag clicking. Like, I can hold it now, and... Yeah, CVS. Oh, these guys are in for a treat. Ooh, very low level. So the best I've drag clicked on this mouse is like 19 CPS. What is wrong with me? So you know how I said like, oh yeah, there's some low stars playing. Well, well, I, I sort of noticed a thing, and that low stars play like absolute turds. And they do random crap like this. And oh, I hate these people. You're gonna try and t you're gonna try and TNT jump. You must think you're so cool, but I think I'm cooler than you. <sighs> I'm angry now. Wait, he left the game. Well, that was a final. Oh my gosh, he has been um there's um uh um uh uh um. I, I feel awfully intimidated. 
Is he hacking? Is he d d auto clicking? What is? Oh no, he's about to bridge above me. Oh, I know what he's about to do. Nope. No, 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 no. Okay, so at about 1 a.m. last night, this was the story I wanted to discuss. So I woke up at around 1 a.m. You know that that's that's chill. That happens sometimes. No big deal. I needed to pee. All right, and then those people are dead. And I just have to hope that white doesn't get me. I oh wow that that explosion made me a little bit scared. Oh that didn't work. That didn't work. That didn't work. He lagged. <laughs> I hate playing. Being an Australian player is so so scuffed. So I turned my light on to check the time on my clock because I forgot that I owned a watch which was on my wrist and I noticed something on the wall. Like a little bit close to my head for my liking but it, it was there. And guess what it was? It was a fat big boy spider. Now that is that is a great exaggeration. And it was a white tail spider because that's what my dad told me and he's a pest controller so I'm pretty sure that I can believe the words of a pest controller. In you know, in regards of identifying a spider. I'm a big brain spider man. Haha. <laughs> oh, I have to go to... Well, okay. I'm not very big brain. I tell a lie. So this thing was probably bigger than a 50 cent coin. Like, for sure. So like the normal average teenage boy I am... I thought to myself, okay, this is it. This is how I die. My dad is a pest controller and he killed one of the spider mafia. And now the spider mafia are after me and they're going to kill him and my mum and everyone that, that I love, including me. And, but I don't even love myself, so I don't even know what they're thinking. Wait, no, but my dad loves me, I think. So, I mean, yay. So I was very responsible and calm. And since it's 1am at this point, because I, you know, I spent a good second, two seconds taking a picture of it to uh, show my parents in the morning. I So I went into my dad's uh, back room, which... Hey, I did a block clutch. Everyone, clout time. This, this is clout time. Yeah, you, you, you are legally required to give me clout for that, for that block clutch. Okay, that is, that is a rule. You have to like, comment, and subscribe now because of that block clutch with a mouse I'm not used to. Okay. <laughs> no, so I see the spider. It sees me. I go and get the little vacuum. It turns out the spider is too big for the vacuum. That is uh, never a good idea. So, um, yeah. Um, that happened. So, so anyway, yeah, I went downstairs and I got the proper vacuum and I was really inconspicuous and I tried to not wake up my parents. I go into the room, I see a spider, I'm like, I'm gonna get you, buddy. I shut the door. Okay, I turn the light on. I turn around. And it's gone. So right now, as I am, as I am recording this video, there is a white-tailed spider in my room. That is fairly large. I, I might die. So if I stop uploading randomly, it's either because of school or, you know, because I'm dead. <laughs> so that's kind of the way it is. But that's my little spider story. I sort of just cut it short and TLDR'd it because the round ended. But there we go. I forgot to mention this, like, literally 10 seconds ago, but I did end up waking my parents up on accident because my dad was coughing really loudly, and I'm like, um, I guess he's awake, so if he's, if he's you know, breathing okay, and he wasn't, he might better help me. Anyways, that's going to be it for the video today. If you enjoyed, leave a like, do that commenty comment thing, and click the subscribe button to give me numbers. I am still going for 2k, and I'm really close now, so... I'm hoping I can get there soon. Uh, I will be doing a full proper review on the Model O soon, but just for now, I'm still getting used to it, and I realize that it is a big learning curve compared to what I expected. Also, regarding the spider story, comment below if you're scared of spiders or your opinion on spiders in general, because, you know, I, I want to talk to you guys because I care about my community. Anyways, thanks for watching, and bye bye